Our setup here is we have a raised sink. The water is going down the drain and through a pipe that goes uh, through the wall. The pipe coming out of the wall, it goes under the shelf and then through a second wall. And here the, the water is draining into um, our mushroom bins. And the mycelium is already growing. It's been in there for uh, how long now? Almost two weeks. And then from here, it comes down. There's a slit in the bottom of this container. If you kind of peek around here, you can see the slit in the bottom of here, and it goes into a pipe that we cut the top off of. And then that pipe channels the water into this garden hose, this old garden hose that Kirk had that we drill holes in, and then that just snakes around and disperses the water. And this one is actually filled with coffee grounds, so it looks a little different. That's inoculated with oyster mushroom mycelium. And the water goes from this pipe here across this worm bin, or across this, this uh, planter bin, and then it goes into this hose. Some of the snakes around, and then we chose plants that um, are both love water and are tolerant of drought in case there's times when there's lots of people in here using the system and times when it's dry and you know over winter break and things like that. So the process is the, the mycelium um, will take out uh, heavy metals or uh, toxins from the water and then um, the hope is that the, the plants will evaporate the water um, but in case of an excess amount of water in the plant bins um, down here, we have some spouts uh, where we can um, drain the bins 